Yankees leading one nothing as we go to the bottom of the second inning and out there in deepest left center field. Yeah that's Meredith Morakovic and Meredith we understand that uh, you've got some answers about what's going on with Aaron Judge. What can you tell us. Kenny it was a big mystery for a while but as David mentioned the Yankees now finally know exactly what is going on with Aaron Judge and that is that he has a stress fracture in his first rib. The course of action right now will be that he'll be shut down for two weeks and then the Yankees will reevaluate put him through some more tests to see how that is healing. Aaron Boone said the other day that they have not ruled out surgery but as of now it has shown signs of healing they're hoping that shutting him down will help that process along a little bit more but it was clear by the comments Aaron Judge made in the clubhouse yesterday there is a ton of frustration there he wants to be out there with his team he wants to be contributing and even he admitted now opening day is not going to happen for him but the Yankees have said time and time again there's no perfect time for an injury by any stretch of the imagination but having it happen early they're able Able to just take their time with Aaron Judge. They want him for the entire season and especially the postseason. So they are not going to rush Aaron Judge right now. They are optimistic that it's going to heal on its own. So that's the best case scenario. What would be the worst case scenario with Aaron Judge? The worst case scenario would be that they would do have to do surgery and then you're looking at quite the time frame for healing. But you don't want to get into that yet. Right now they're hoping that after two weeks it's going to show some more signs of healing and then maybe a couple more weeks and he'll be able to do some baseball activity but there is another outfielder Kenny that's doing some baseball activity right now moving in the right direction and that would be Giancarlo Stanton there's yeah. a lot of firepower out of the lineup for the Yankees right now there's no doubt about it. John Carlos Stanton did start doing some baseball activity. He's expected to play catch today at George M. Steinbrenner Field. Also doing some tee and toss work in the cage. And Aaron Boone said that he is running on the Alter G treadmill. Now, Kenny or David, have you guys ever been on an Alter G treadmill? Huh, let me see. Ultra, I've been on a regular one, but <laughs> not, not an Alter G. Down in Soho one night. I, was, I, was on one. I am so scared to hear the entirety of that story, Coney. But for those of you at home that do not know what an Alter G treadmill is, it's essentially make sure that you don't put your complete body weight. It's an anti-gravity treadmill, so they can really regulate exactly how much pressure you're putting on your joints. So they'll eventually increase you a little bit more every time until you finally get to 100% body weight that you're able to put that on that cap. But they're going to bring him along slowly but the fact that he's doing some baseball activity activity is certainly a sign that he is moving in the right direction fly ball down the left field line and this is going to drop fair just on the line and Duhar will pick it up it's going to be a two base hit for Gregory Polanco as the Pirates have moved the uh, time run to the scoring position with one out here in the second inning now you've got some news on Gary Sanchez and uh, you know is he a little iffy or whatever well, Gary Sanchez was never scheduled to play here in Bradenton. He actually played last night. He caught, and it was the first time all spring that he had caught back-to-back -back games. And Aaron Boone said that he was not in either list of batting practice groups at George M. Steinbrenner Field today because he was feeling a little something in his back right now. According to Aaron Boone, that is nothing to be overly concerned about. It's something as catchers are getting ready throughout the spring. Sometimes they have some aches and pains, but they do not believe this is anything that is going to keep him out for any length of time when I asked whether or not he would be on the field tomorrow taking BP Aaron Boone said depending on how he feels they may give him an extra day but they do expect him back out there on Monday. Well Meredith thank you for the updates on the injured Yankees and we understand you do have some uh, interviews for us later on in the, in the ball game. We are expecting to hear from some of the outfielders who are going to have to step up Mike Talkman Miguel and Duhar who's getting his first work in the outfield this spring training. Nice play by Estrada. Thank you, Meredith. And the Pirates Polanco will move over to the third with two outs.